It is undoubtedly that necessity is the mother of invention. Thousands of cases of hijacking are reported worldwide and hundreds of road accidents occur countrywide each year. At Kenyatta University's Gender Innovation Center, these two brothers have stepped in to find a permanent solution to these two challenges. Jacob Maina, aged 25, and Douglas Mwangi, who is 27 years old, are graduates of Mo University and Jomo Kenyatta University of Agriculture and Technology, respectively. Jacob studied securities, while Douglas specialized in procurement. They emerged victors in the recently concluded Common Market for Eastern and Southern Africa Awards held in Ethiopia, the best in Africa under the innovation category. Lack of road safety is a bigger problem even than cancer in Africa. So when we brought a solution that we reduced that, that's why even our innovation was picked. And against, again, our innovation is very practical and very effective. They have invented a system which helps one monitor the speeding of his or her car, demobilize and alert friends and relatives when attacked, just to mention but a few. In 1996, if I may go back there, our pickup, my father's pickup was stolen and um, it took so many years to recover it because we recovered it in uh, 201. We wanted to, to, to tackle crime. We wanted to tackle uh, the accidents and reduce them, and that is why we have continually developed this system. We are now focusing completely on the system, and so we've been developing that, we've been developing that, and last year, that was in 2008, oh, sorry, 2010, then uh, last year is when we enrolled it out. The initiative dubbed Garim Kononi has helped most of their customers. We didn't have the, so many aspects of the business, the marketing, the HR, the PR, and we needed now a partner, person who would come in and help us in uh, tackling this. Yeah? We didn't want to start from scratch to reinvent the wheel. So we came in and uh, we came to Chandaria. They took our idea in, they offered all these aspects and uh, that has really helped our, uh, our business to grow. Jacob texted me through some of the services they offer. When Aparastatu, lets, uh, Aparastatu has many cars and they have the system, they basically come to this site, select all the cars that are at the parking that are not being used, assuming it's on a Friday, and then you come and stop all of them. Mm -hmm. So the driver won't use the cars until Monday. Mm -hmm. When you overspeed, it sends an SMS. We are used to the speed guns police and as mom and a speed gun but in this case the system reports to maybe the police or the car owner or the circle or chairman and keeps that report for as many months as five months mm -hmm. six months one year so in case a driver is being told in a court case mm -hmm. you are overspeeding on a particular day they just need to go to the Buy system get the overspeed report the system can also be used to deal with mischievous drivers sometimes the driver will call you and tell you i didn't go to a certain place i, I only used liquor road i didn't go anywhere so you just come to the system log in and then it shows you all the routes mm -hmm. the car passed, yeah, passed yeah. all the way, mm -hmm. any place it was parked, mm -hmm. for how long it stayed stoppage time, for how long it stayed. So for this car, it came to this location, mm -hmm. was parked there for 31 minutes. Mm -hmm. In case this car, somebody tries to, 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 to interfere with it, I have a box here. This is the client interface. He has a box here. He will just see an interference, and this car will stop being red or, or, or yellow when it's idling and show grey. The system is integrated with a SIM card fixed invisibly in the vehicle and one only needs a password to use the system. So each minute the cars it is essential to the system. We choose to demonstrate practically how the system can help somebody disable his stolen car. Apple. In a reenactment, Douglas parks his vehicle here to meet someone shortly. A thief comes and drives off with it. He comes only to find his vehicle stolen. He simply sends the word stop oil with his password to the SIM card inserted in the vehicle and the vehicle stops by replying stop oil OK. But he confirms it has stopped. Upon noticing that the vehicle can no longer move, the driver runs away. Well, once I sent the, the stopping car by SMS. Or why do you think the car, the Kajaka left the car here? 
Uh, because uh, the car cannot start. Mm -hmm. It cannot start. We have done for around 151. We have in a period of around six months. When you are hijacked, you, are, you don't have time to pick your phone mm. or call someone. Yeah? Mm. You press this button. <laughs> You press it like that. Mm -hmm. When you release it, mm. it sends an SMS mm. to the person uh, whom you have authorized to receive the SMS. Mm -hmm. yeah, maybe your wife, your girlfriend, mm -hmm. your husband, your brother. The After button, mm -hmm. he pressed the button. Mm -hmm. It gave me a link mm -hmm. with the exact position where he is. Mm -hmm. So when I click this link, it shows me here. Mm -hmm. It gives me the speed. Mm -hmm. It gives me the time, mm -hmm. the date, and help me. Mm -hmm. The word help me. Mm -hmm. Um, so that I can know he's in danger. In case I wanted to know where Douglas want, wants to be helped from, he just to click this link here. Click the, link. the vehicle is also fitted with the high density hidden microphones that when carjacked will enable one to hear the conversation in the car when he or she calls the system. <laughs> In case you are ultimately hijacked and thrown out of the car, all you need is a mobile phone. Somebody near you is in a mobile phone. So you borrow somebody's phone and send an SMS to the car to stop it. You send the SMS plus the password or the PIN. So the moment you send that stop SMS, it stops immediately. For one to be fitted any of the systems, one has to part with a one-off fee of between 30,000 and 50,000 Kenyan shillings. Our goal is to see this being implemented, especially in all the public service vehicles, to totally reduce uh, crime and accidents. According to these brothers, innovation can be a solution to some of the problems that the country is experiencing at the moment. Hence, demonstrating that creativity and determination are the sole ingredients of success. Victor Wetende, Ibru TV, Nairobi.